Hello YouTube, Real Shooting here and in today's video I'm going to be painting two lures. I've already went ahead and sprayed it with the first coat, the white coat. I already have the red loaded up. I'm going to spray these completely red. And then I'm going to use my new stencil here. Order this online from Insane Custom Stencils. This is the Craw Wheel number one. They have a different, a couple of different ones. I believe there's probably like three different ones many stencils though they have a lot of stencils not just crawls but my idea is to make these two the same so I'm gonna spray them both red and then use that stencil to do the black lines on them for the crawfish pattern let me hit this with the red first let's see if I can get a good angle here hopefully that's a good angle man that, that red is very liquidy let's see how it sprays Looks pretty good. I'm gonna go ahead and get the other side now. There we go, we got a red crankbait. I'm gonna go ahead and spray the other one off camera. And then I'll show you guys that final result. You guys stay tuned. All right, you guys, they're both red. They've had some time to dry by now and I have the black color loaded up into my air gun already. And I think I wanna use, I'm not sure which crawl lines here. These or these? these right here and I'm no pro at this but I'm just gonna line them up right here and spray it with the black hopefully it comes out pretty good something like this I think that's how it should line up right here let's see here goes nothing. I don't really like that. There has to be a better way. I have to hold the stencil like pretty close to it, I'm thinking. 
And then to get the other side, you want to dry this off too. I do know that. It's going to take some practice, that's for sure. sure how I like this you guys wow seems like the first side looks better <coughs> interesting 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 probably gonna let that dry continue the lines and then probably do a different pattern on the other one you guys stay tuned all right you guys the final product I am not entirely, not even partly happy with how these two came out. I'm going to say it is trickier than what people make it seem on YouTube. And I try to do this little top shell pattern up here. Those little legs, they're very tricky. Trying to get those on there real nice. I feel like the first side came out even better. And then on my second one, that just looks bad right here sort of like two lines got connected I did do pretty good with the shell there I feel like and then that side doesn't look as bad I still know that these two will work I know they will catch fish I mean these are just swimming by quickly all they're gonna see is the red and black pattern on that crankbait anyways if you enjoyed today's video you guys just a short video painting some lures I'm gonna watch some more videos on how to do this I'm gonna keep practicing and I'll come out with a part two, painting the exact same, probably also red and black. I really like the red and black crawfish pattern, but I could do other ones. Like I have this fluorescent green. I want to try a green and black crankbait. Maybe a pink and black. We got a purple. We got some orange too. Look at that. We could do an orange and black crankbait. But I'm going to keep practicing. This is not that good, but anyways. And there's my stencil. Hope you enjoyed today's video, you guys. Just a short one. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to comment, rate, and subscribe.